Good afternoon, everyone. Um, I'm creating this video because I grow pawpaws um, like this one. This is um, a sapling, one year old, less than one year old. And I tend to give a lot of these away for the purpose of conservation. Now, as you can see, these are grown in really long tap roots uh, pots, and um, they're quite tricky to to plant. So this is the purpose of this video is to show some of the people that I've given these to how to plant them. I've planted quite a few. Um, as you can see, I can barely even catch this in the video. Let me uh, move this back a bit. And you can see it like that. Um, okay, so here we go. So you want to dig a hole, obviously the same size, if not a little more of this taproot pot. And um, once you've dug in your hole, add a little bit of decent soil in there, uh, some compost, and mix a little bit of the old native um, soil in with it. So when you've dug your hole, and I've dug my hole, you want to grab the, the pot, put your fingers in there so no soil can escape, but you're not crushing the stem, and go upside down. Sometimes it will fall right down. I can feel it slip down. The base of the soil is right at my hands. If not, just push on it with your finger until it comes down, okay? This is the easy part. This is the tricky part. You do not want to break the tap root. It will most likely kill the plant. So this is the only real problematic part right here and an awkward part as well. Um, so you want to, you have to go fast. You want to flip the pot right out and grab it with your one hand like this. Okay, you gotta be quick. You do not want that tap root to break. If the soil um, comes off, it's no big deal as long as you have the tap root in place, okay? And then you just kinda go like that, carefully with both hands and plant it in the hole and uh, that's it. So, and then you obviously want to put some of the native soil, mix in the native soil with some good compost right to the top of the base and water it well. And that's it, guys. So happy planting.